just finished up another gym session, come to the realization, I need to stop cursing so much. It's a, uh, it's an issue. I'm trying my best to rectify that. You know, I was reading one of the, uh, I was reading, which, which book was I reading? One of Paul's books. I wrote, wrote down in my journal. I gotta be a little bit more uh, on point with these verses, but you know, it says if you walk with Christ, you gotta stop cursing, stop using profane language. That's like an actual thing. I'm trying my best to stop cursing, but I have been cursing since I was a child, man. I grew up around it, you know, my family, you know, we're from Jamaica. My family's from Jamaica and, uh, you know, profanity is part of the culture, it's part of how we speak, you know? And, and it's, and for me, it's like, I curse as a means of expressing myself, okay? But it's not good, it's definitely uncouth and I definitely have to stop. But on top of that too, you know, when I tell stories, cursing definitely, <laughs> using profanity definitely makes things more lighthearted and more funnier. <sighs> it's hard. I really, had to, I really had to figure out a way to stop cursing. Um, you know, in 48 Laws of Power, it definitely does say something about not using profane language because it makes you too common. It makes you like the common man. Oh my God, excuse me. It makes you like the common man. And I don't see myself as the common man. I definitely see myself above average, okay? Not to exalt myself, but I definitely see myself above average. I strive to be above average, but I have to stop cursing. And things like this, though, I'll, I'll keep it a real view. I definitely recognize in my private life and also when I'm out publicly, I catch myself not trying to curse, okay? I, 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 that's clear. Like when I curse, I try to immediately atone for it, okay? And I immediately try to tell myself, I gotta stop cursing, I gotta stop cursing, I gotta stop cursing, okay? I definitely have to stop cursing. I, you know, I wanna be as pure as possible, but it's tough, it's hard especially when I'm working in an environment where people always curse all the time. And definitely cursing helps you get the point across very clearly to a lot of people, but it is childish language. I know as I'm making this video now, things are not going to be perfect. And I know moving forward, you're going to see me curse here and there. Ah, something I got to work on for sure. Uh, it's going to take a long time. It's not easy. It's going to take years for me to stop cursing because it's literally part of my vernacular. It's part of my writing. It's how I write. It's how I tell stories. It's how I lighten the mood. But still, it's not an excuse. I got to improve. I got to be better out here for these kids. Can they look up to me, right? They see me as the alpha male. They do not believe in that. It's foolishness. All that foolishness on the internet. But I definitely have to stop cursing. And this red car keeps driving back and forth looking for something. I don't know what's going on with him, weirdo. But anyway, I got errands to run. Let me get some sun and uh, get to work, man. Oh my God. Oh my goodness. I mean, this job is a chore.